Okay, day one of now since this is a lengthy trip for 2017, I'm not gonna say how many days. I'm not gonna say much, but I'm on my way on the 15, and I'm going to take that 15. There's a great shot of a, a train uh, coming down the hill. It's got full-on brakes cruising. You can see dust flying. You could. Hopefully you can see it again. This is really a... See, they, look at that. That is a long... Oh, he's going up. That guy's chugging up. That is a long, long... He's probably got six engines on there. Minimum. Minimum. That's a huge grade. This is one of the major, like, uh, railroad things. We've got a couple of them here in uh, California. This, the Hatchby Loop. Uh, of course, those are the only two that are popping into mind now, but there's several, like, railroad milestones that, are, that were done here because... You know, it's the freaking wild west. How do you go from the high desert down to nothing, down to sea level? Hard to do with a giant train, especially the older ones. So there you go, that's cool. Uh, oh, there you go. So I'm going all the way up to uh, Logan. And uh, Provo couple other places. I'm not going to tell you where my son lives. He doesn't live in either of those places. But, uh, yeah, so there you go. Then all that. Cars. I hardly have any left where I'm at. And they're well locked down. There's uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12 cameras on the property that I'm at in California. There's eight cameras at the property in Utah with round the clock surveillance, 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 reserval, servals, people watching. <laughs> Man, I'm tired. I got up like, I went to bed at five in the morning. I got up at nine which is pretty good, but I just got up in like a, a shock, like holy crap, and that was it, and that's not a good way to get up, and so I had to, you know, get everything ready, uh, stupid phone was all jacked up, Verizon sucks, so I'm going to drop them right after this trip, and uh, again for the third time. So Verizon sucks, just for you, you, you know, that is true. I don't know where I'm going to go to. I'm going to try to find some kind of old track phone, because that was the best one. Yeah, I mean, no one can understand you, but, you know, you got a phone, and it's cheap. And for being called track phone, it's great, because you can't track anybody. So, I love it. A burner phone is a cop's belly. So there you go. Um, yeah, so this is it for California. I probably won't, unless I see something incredible, probably won't say anything else until I hit the, wherever I stop tonight. Which I, I was going, I was planning on stopping in Vegas, but we had that thing happen. We, as a country, Let's get back to thinking that way, okay? We are a country. Screw far left Democrats. Screw far right Republicans. This is idiotic now. Start thinking like Americans or get out. You're either an American or you're not. Get out. You're not a far left. You're not a liberal. 
uh, whatever. If you're going to think that way, goodbye. And if you're going to be some crazy far-right guy, goodbye, because it doesn't work that way. You can think that way, but you got to be able to work with people. And if you can't, then you're screwed. It's good to have people that think both ways, and then you come to a decision in the middle-ish. Hopefully leaning more towards your side. And, it, and that's how it's been since the beginning. And we are not an old country. Very young. Very, very, very young. There's a lot of civilizations that lost, lasted a lot longer than us. And we're already blowing it. So, you know, stop it. Stop being an idiot. Start being an American. And that's that. All right?